Welcome to this Express Full Body Pilates by the Sea workout. All you need is yourself and a mat, and let's get ready to go. We're going to start with your feet underneath your sit bones. Taking a deep squat, reach down, forward and up, and circle your arms around and down towards your hips, driving out of your heels and squeezing your glutes at the top. Resist your hands coming down towards your hips, and try not to let your ribcage flare open as you reach your arms overhead. Now we're going to take a soft bend, reaching one arm up and over. Mermaid stretch and take it up and over to the other side. Good, sliding that top shoulder down and back, opening up through the side of the rib cage and bring it back through center. Hands reach forward, we'll pull one elbow back behind you squeezing that shoulder blade around the back of the rib cage and release to reach it forward. Do your best to keep your hips square. So soften your knees so you feel grounded into your mat and just twist from the waistline up, opening up through your chest and your collarbones. Now come to the back of your mat and bring your feet underneath your sit bones, feet in parallel. We're gonna drop your chin to your chest and slowly roll ourselves down, releasing one vertebra at a time. Give your head a little shake at the bottom, shake it yes, shake it no. And slowly roll yourself back up to re-stack your spine, one vertebra at a time, head comes up last. And we'll go again, rolling yourself down, peeling your spine off an imaginary wall behind you. And when you get to the bottom this time, I want you to rock yourself from your right foot to your left foot and let your body sway, imagining you're a broken rag doll. Bringing it back through center and rolling yourself back up. Roll yourself down one more time. Soften your knees so your hands touch the floor and walk your hands out into a high plank position. Set your hands underneath your shoulders. Pull your belly button in towards your spine. Take a few deep breaths here, breathing in through your nose and out through pursed lips, really engaging through your core as you press through your palm and your pinky fingers. And let's release your knees down. Well done, sit back into your shell, stretch hips to heels, scooping the belly in and up and reaching your mid back up to the ceiling. Now let's come back into four point kneeling. I want you to extend your right arm and left leg long, stretching and lifting up and bringing the elbow to knees to stretch it back out. Elbow to knee and extend that arm and leg out. Keep pressing through your left palm and pinky fingers so you don't sink into that shoulder blade. We wanna keep the hips level. Last one and bring your right hand back down, but keep your left leg lifted. We're gonna take it into our Pilates push-up, bending your elbows, dropping your chest towards the floor and reaching that toe up towards the sky. Keep those elbows tight to your sides so you work into your triceps. Using your breath, inhale down and exhale to lift. Now come back up and drop it down onto your right form, opening your body to the side. Tap that left toe down and back up. Now hold that leg up and bend your knee, bringing your heel into your glutes, and then bend at your hip, bringing your knee towards your shoulder. So heel to glutes and knee to shoulder. This one is an amazing exercise to strengthen and tone up your glutes. Reaching that leg up, let's slowly lower it down and come all the way onto your side. Keep that bottom knee bent, top leg long, lift up onto your form for a side plank. We're going to bend elbow to knee and stretch it out long. Keep lifting those hips and do your best to keep those hips stacked. 
and go ahead and release, stretching those legs all the way out, tip those hips forward, rock onto the back of the hips, and we'll sweep both legs up to the sky, reaching those fingertips up as well into your twisted teaser. And last one to release all the way down onto your front. So now we're gonna take a gentle extension, taking your hands underneath your shoulders and peeling your chest off the floor, lifting up into your swan stretch. Now, if your arms don't fully extend, that's okay. You go to wherever it feels comfortable for you. Lower it down and we're going to reach those arms out overhead. I'd like you to lift your right arm and left leg and then left arm and right leg. So opposite arm to leg will lift and lower. Keep tucking your tailbone under and peeling your belly button off the mat. Then when you feel good, go ahead and flutter your arms and legs. Keep stretching them long, releasing those shoulders down and back. Flutter, 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 flutter. And then reach out long to release and lower it down. Hands under shoulders, push your hips back to your heels, shell stretch and release that lower back. All right, we are going to reset for your second side. So hands under shoulders, knees under hips in your quadruped. This time we extend your left arm and right leg, stretch out long and then bend elbow to knee and reach out. Keep pressing through your right palm and pinky finger. Try not to sink into that right shoulder. Keep drawing the belly in and up, and then you're gonna hold that leg up and bring your arm back down. Taking it into your Pilates push-up, soften your elbows. Drop your chest to the floor as your leg reaches up to the sky, and then push the floor away. We inhale to lower and exhale to lift. Last one, now come down onto your left forearm and open your body to the side. We're tapping that right leg down and up. Holding that leg up, we're going to bend your knee and then bring your knee into your shoulder. So heel to glutes and knee to shoulder. Heel to glutes and knee to shoulder. reaching that leg long and lower it down to come down onto your side keeping that bottom leg bent top leg straight lift that top arm up and draw elbow to knee cinching into the waistline keeping those hips lifted good reaching it out long and extending your bottom leg tilting the hips forward Top arm reaches overhead and we rock onto the back of the sit bones, reaching those toes up to your top hand for your twisted teaser. Make sure you rock all the way back onto the cushiony bit of your glutes. And release into your extension, roll onto your front again taking those legs nice and wide, letting your heels drop in. Arms are going to reach up overhead and we're going to take it into your breast stroke. We exhale to dive those arms overhead and we inhale and circle them around down towards your hips. When you do this, I want you to squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Keep looking down at the floor to keep the back of the neck long. Exhale to dive forward, inhale, circle and lift. Last one, two, release it down, push your hips back to your heels, shell stretch. Slowly roll yourself up and flip yourself around to lie down onto your back. We're gonna lift one leg up to tabletop and then the other. Glide your bottom ribs to hips to imprint your lower back into the floor. We stretch arms and legs out long. We circle your arms around and back into your shins for your double leg stretch. We're 
Let's hold it here, arms and legs stretch long, lower your arms and legs a little closer to the floor. Keep pressing that lower back into the mat and hug your knees back in. Hands come behind the head and we take it into our obliques. Drawing one knee in, one leg out as we twist our opposite shoulder to the knee. Now to get a little bit more challenge in here, try and circle your chest up and around like a little rainbow, keeping those shoulder blades just off the floor. Bring it back through center, release your head and hands down. Let's press those thighs away an inch and bring those knees in towards your chest to lift those hips up. Tiny little reverse curl here. Getting into your rollover prep. Bring it back into tabletop, hands reach forward. Curl your head, neck, and shoulders off the floor and pump your hands to the floor for your hundreds. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, five. Now see if you can add your legs. Breathing in, bringing your knees in, exhaling and stretching your legs out long. Keep pressing your lower back into the floor. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, five. Good, keep pumping those arms. Last one, hold those legs long, reach those arms back overhead, press that lower back into the floor. Hold it, hold it, hold it, circle it around and in, head is down. Go ahead and rock and roll yourself up and flip yourself around into four point kneeling into your quadruped. Let's take it into your angry cat and cow stretch. Rounding through the spine, scooping that belly in and up and releasing to look forward, extending into cow, lengthening those abdominals. And I stretch through your spine, bringing it back into neutral. Tuck the toes, lift the hips, pedal those heels to the floor and walk your hands into your toes. Slowly roll yourself all the way back up to standing, head comes up last. Feet underneath your sit bones, reaching those arms up overhead. Rise up to find your balance, pressing through your big toes. Open those arms out, grow taller as you lower your heels down and release. Well done, you guys, that is it. You've completed your express Pilates workout for a full body blitz. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification button so you never miss my weekly workouts. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye, guys.